It's C2E2 only on the Daily Quirk. Thank you, Casey, for joining us today. Uh, we're lovely to have you at C2E2. Uh, we do have some questions about how everybody's still mourning the death of your character on Lost Girl. Um, was it weird to say goodbye to that character? It really was. Yeah. It really, really was. Um, the last day for Hale mm -hmm. on the set of Lost Girl was very emotional. I would imagine so. Um, and, uh, you know, we pretty much saved that scene for the last scene of the day and um, yeah I I let out a few tears yeah yeah you know there was a little speech at the end and I just choked up and I, I couldn't go through with it um, it's one of those things that hits you at a specific moment which is usually the moment you're not expecting it to right. it just kind of bam hits you and you kind of hit a wall and you're just like wow it's really done it's it's over yeah know um, so it was very emotional for me as an actor and um, because I, I love the character and, and yeah. really I started to love it more once the fans loved it so much so right. that was just great to see their appreciation of the character and, yeah um, yeah any chance for some sort of return on the show or well any? I mean this is sci-fi right there's always exactly. a chance but with that said I also must say that not one you see? I don't see it. Okay. I don't see it. That's, so That's fair. Um, you know, and a lot of people have asked me about that. And um, the only thing I can really say to them is if you want him back. Let them know. Let them know you want him back. Yeah. Um, but, uh, you know, it, it was good for myself and it was good for the show, I felt. Yeah. You know, but um, this is sci-fi and what the fans want, the fans should get. Yeah. That's why things. we're at C2E2, exactly. right? <laughs> so did you have a favorite moment uh, or like scene that you got to film while you were on Lost Girl? Yeah, you know, um, I mean, there were so many. Oh, obviously, sure. How do you pick from all the good ones? Right. But, um, but I can't pick. Okay. So I will. <laughs> um, you know what? The, probably the first scene that I shot. Yeah was the best one for me awesome. and the most memorable just because I didn't shoot the pilot right. originally. So, I mean, we did reshoot it to get me in there, right. but I wasn't part of the original uh, pilot. So I kind of just showed up on set for the next episode and they were like, uh, Chris, KC, KC, Chris, which is Chris Holden Reed, mm -hmm. um, Dyson. And that's how we met, and we jumped into a scene together. Nice. And it just went like this. Awesome. So for that's, me, that's... That's a good feeling. Yeah. I mean, you know, if this is the guy you're going to work with for the whole season, mm -hmm. that's how you want it to work out. Awesome. Um, so that was, I think, the... That was the scene where we're in the alleyway, and Kenzie comes along, and I do my siren. Anyway, so awesome. it, was, it, was, it was great. Okay. Well, your character on Saving Hope, though, is still very much alive. Uh, can you tell us what it's like playing the dog? For now. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I just, you, I just say that because... Are you hinting at something? You know what? I just say that because uh, I don't know how many people have seen Robocop yet, so uh, yeah. I'll put it out there. Uh, <laughs> so I get killed in Robocop as well. Okay. Possibly. We don't know for sure okay. if I die. But let's just say I get injured, which it, it could be looked at as death but um so everyone keeps saying gosh why do you keep dying right so now we're at saving hope who knows what's gonna happen okay but uh i love playing the doc the doc is awesome yeah um it's such a obviously left field from from right. hell um which would be this way not this way <laughs> but um you know it's it's a great and he's such he's got such attitude yeah he's got this he's just got a chip on his shoulder mm -hmm. i love that it's gotta be fun to play it's gotta be fun all right, and so while you're here at C2E2, is there something specific you're looking forward to or just a general thing you're You know what, you're excited same about? as always, the, co the costumes. Yeah. I love the costumes, love cosplay. Yeah. Um, I think it's just, it's. I'm not brave enough to do it. Okay. So I enjoy it. Okay. You know, and um, I think everyone does it extremely well. All right. So that's what I'm looking forward to. 
Awesome. Do you have a favorite science fiction or fantasy story that maybe you'd like to see the costume stuff even? I don't, I, you know, I don't, I, I, I'm a big never ending story. Ah, uh, yes. Is anyone yes. else with me? Uh huh. <laughs> okay. I'm a child of the 80s. Okay. Cool. So I, that's, that's what I enjoy. Yeah. Um, yeah. Awesome. I mean, the, the new stuff is great, but. Yeah, there's something magical I, before they could really do all the special stuff. Absolutely. Yeah, you really had to believe. Yeah. So, absolutely. wonderful. That's awesome to hear. So, thank you so much <laughs> for talking with well. us. I hope you enjoy your time at C2E2. Thank you. Hope there's a lot of uh, costumes that, that meet your expectations. There better be. <laughs> <laughs> all right, thank you so much. You're welcome. Um, and can we get into the camera just like a high daily quirk? Yeah, hello, daily quirk. Thank you so much.